Peter, Peter, many congratulations. 6-3 victory in your opening game of the World Series. How are you feeling after the performance and display? It was okay. Uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, I wanted to go out and uh, do better than that, but obviously uh, uh, just try and get the win was the, the most important thing. And I've got that. Still averaged over 100, though, which seems to be your staple benchmark game, though. Yeah, I'm getting old and boring. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like to play in front of fans again and you could be snake bite again? Oh, that was amazing. That was really good. Uh, you know, I interacted with the crowd and the crowd was fantastic. And, uh, you know, it was, uh, you know, but everyone's got a work. Uh, and be sensible. Obviously, the BBC's done a fantastic job. Uh, Matt Porter and the gang, and I think with the officials uh, in Austria, and I think, and to have the fans in, you know, it's fantastic. So, uh, fingers crossed for, you know, darts and next, next games coming up, you know. I say, does this prove to everyone across Europe that it can be done safely? Yeah, as long as, you know, people have got to be sensible, you know, that's, you know, I think that's what's happened with the, uh, the lockdown, I think everyone, you know, had a tough time, lot of time uh, the lockdown, and it was lifted, and everyone went, oh, let's go on holiday, and then no one stuck by the rules, and so that's why this, everything's um, you know, pear-shaped again, but, you know, we've all got to be sensible, you know, you've got to look after the elder, elderly people, and, you know, and stuff like that, it's, just because you want to go out, have a bit of fun, it's, you know, it's lives at risk. Heading here, obviously, we had the Autumn Series. How would you assess your Autumn Series? You picked up one title, but were you disappointed not to add to it after the opening day? Oh, yeah. Uh, I'm glad, I, you know, I won one of them. Uh, obviously, I wanted to win all of them, uh, but it was very difficult. It was very hot. And obviously, again, with, a, you know, uh, all the BBC Europe and BBC... But uh, we managed to, you know, run a, you know, fantastic tournament. So everyone uh, got their chance to win some money, get themselves into the Grand Prix, Grand Slam, i.e., and get themselves up ready for the, you know, the World Championships. And looking ahead, Daryl Gurney up next. Another tough game for yourself. He played his best game on TV for a while this evening. Looking forward to that one. Did he play well, really? I ain't got further than watching. He's boring. Yeah, 102. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what we got? Uh, no, he's, you know, uh, me and Daryl always, well, nine times out of ten, we have a, a cracker and he always comes out on top, but tomorrow it's my turn, so lucky, Daryl. <laughs> Peter, pleasure as always, Chad. Thanks very much. Cheers, bro. Uh, Peter, we know you always enjoy your travels on the World Series. How much have you missed it this year? Uh, uh, obviously, I've, you know, I wanted to go to New, uh, New York and experience all the mental mad people go around screaming, fire engines and everything like that. Uh, you know, um, uh, yeah. uh, and drawing Fallon in the first round. <laughs> uh, no, uh, it's, you know, it's a shame. Uh, you know, we haven't been able to represent the darts all around the world again. Obviously, we've gone to Australia and different places and stuff like that. And, uh, you know, it's a shame, but... As I said before, it's just people just be sensible and we can all get back to normal. How have you found the last week or so? Because it's been a while since you've had to travel so far into Europe with darts. How, how have you found that? It's, it, it's, it's been really good, you know, get back to darts and playing uh, some, uh, you know, all the top players of the world and all the players who, uh, who want to be top players in the world, you know. I got beat by some quality players, uh, you know, and. Uh, Form series, but you go for this, you know, they want my place when they've got to work hard. Right.